Welcome back to more time to this, the first episode of Until Dawn. Today we're continuing. To, we're not continuing anything. We are starting. Um. Traditional, I guess. I don't even quite know. So much light on not one side of my face. Fuck's sake! It's not much better, but whatever. Traditional it is. I'm going traditional because um, I I don't I'm not good with motion controls. So the scares try to begin. I knew it was coming. I've not played this before, so this is this is my first time running through it. I just knew it was, it was just predictable, you know. Let's do the butterfly effect. <clears throat> a tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now. How does that make sense? I don't think that makes much sense. Whatever! The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. He's trying to give me an analogy. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. If I decide to not kill one guy, you may die like. <laughs> you might die later on. May die later on, I don't know. Your story. It's one of many possibilities. A lot of possible. Like, are they, are they all these thingies, like, things? Choose your actions carefully. Right. I know there's a way of finishing this game killing everybody. I know there's a way of finishing this game killing nobody. I'm just gonna play. If I kill people, I kill people. If I don't, I don't. You know? First of all, pause. Subtitles. Resume, okay. No. Okay, so no so no no subtitles for me then. Mr. Murderer Man, how are you this fine oh day? Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh, shh. Don't you guys think this is a little bit wrong? Oh, come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah has been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. I am. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. So what's going on? I have like no idea what's going on right now. I heard the music sound like a buzz. I looked down there. I'm using my phone to record. So. Hannah. <laughs> Perhaps I should have turned this, the pointers on the four plane. <laughs> Some bad shit's gonna go down. <laughs> Sometimes we're already unconscious. I have lived so much to drink. Hey, did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Ah, uh, so you're gonna go outside, aren't you? Ah, <sighs> the subtitle, just please. Sidebar text, was that? Um, yeah? I don't quite know what that does, but whatever. Joshy Poo! Where are you? Hello! This must be living there. Do you, Josh? To look around. Object that. Okay. I don't know how to speak in this stupid accent. What are you? You the vodka? That was a rub. That's some strong shit. 
That is definitely some strong shit. Jeez, Josh. Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Um. <laughs> or some kind of whiskey, vodka, or something like that. I don't know. Uh, just saw another shiny thingy over here. What is this? Piece of piece of paper. Ha, Hannah! You look so damn hot in that. Ah, oh, that's what the overlay is. Right, right, okay. Uh, Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shit. I, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m. Mike. X, X, X. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? She gonna get. I don't know. I got your note. That's a good He already looks like an asshole. You can just tell he's a dick. And Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Am I gonna get done for oh torn off? She's taking her shirt. Uh, hair, butterfly what? effects, your butterfly oh cut Oh my off. god! Matt! What are you doing here? Oh. Hannah! I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, Let's all get out of here. Just a stupid prank. Uh. Oh, hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Anybody Hannah. scared yet? Because I'm not. Like this video if you jump to anything, open it when the Until Dawn popped up on the screen. Or use the right stick to choose what? Wake Josh, find others. I'm a wake Josh. Josh! Josh! I don't think I'm wake Fuck! What's your language, Amy? See? Guys, there's someone outside. What the hell? Oh, fuck. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We just messed around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Why did this, her hair not move? Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, it's I windy. Why is her head? Oh, she wants to that's gonna right piss me off like that. Press the correct action button for the time oh, shit. Or give me the fucking action button. Square! Fast or safe? Fast. Oh, that's the right. I want to do the right. Fast. Triangle! And yeah, I'm gonna yell on this one. Fucking can. Fuck you. Judging me. Follow footprints, of course. I just fucked up. Didn't I? <laughs> oh, God. Like a save option in the pause. No. Where are you? Can we just quit? I, oh, I swear, God, if I can't just quit at any time. Right, I gotta record three of these videos. Three episodes of this. I'm gonna be so pissed off if I can't just quit and come back at any time. Use the touchpad as shown. Okay. Out. Hannah. Yeah. My name's Is that a thing? Oh my god, I'm actually making footprints. Oh my god. I'm not always making footprints. Keep the torch on the ground. Hello, Mr. Deer. Oh, now I'm going to walk faster. You're not supposed to control the torch. Right, love. I'm supposed to. Hello? Hi. Hello? Hello? Anybody out there? Hello! It's a totem. I thought that was a shoe. Oh my gosh. Oh, hello. That's a nice a death totem. <laughs> oh, okay. Indigenous tribe, black death, the possible death of the person who finds it. 
Can they just kill this girl? Indigenous tribes believe that butterflies brought dreams and premonitions. Each totem piece foretells a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. So as you unlock titans, totems, the events of the past will become clear. But you're not going to take it, alright, don't... I suppose I picked it up. That's, that's the collectible, collectible. I'm good at English, shut up! What kind of blood? I think I, I think blood. What the hell was that? I don't know, but it made me jump. Maybe a little bit. A bit jump. Hannah. Hannah. Hello. Hannah. Oh my God, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Hannah. Um, what? A decision to make. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Uh, uh, Drop Hannah or let um uh, 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 I don't know. I'm so Hannah. sorry. Didn't make a difference. Okay, no. Ooh, shit. And there is our death totem. Okay, that's the one decision I knew that did make a difference. What I chose. The rest of it, I honestly don't know. But that is the one I didn't. I knew it wouldn't make a difference. Whether I dropped or let or let go, they both died. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You sound like an asshole. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom. In this you are the mob boss from you Prison do, Break, right? You make from Maybe I'll see that. This is, um... To the future. What's his name? I want you to break. remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, talking to us. You have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Well. Sometimes. Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying. But I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up cards? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and <laughs> tell me what you feel about it. it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. That's a farm. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, Hungry. be honest. I don't know. It makes me happy. I feel uneasy. Yeah, bad shit always goes down on the phone. Okay, honesty is good. <laughs> what do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? 
Bad shit always happens on with the scarecrow. Well, I see. I see. Let's see. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say, no. For example. Oh hell no. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> oh no. Why not? I'd be lonely. Yeah. I don't think you'd be scared, I'd just be I go stir crazy. There's a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. Perhaps this is something we can explore in the future. Hmm? Because I'm afraid we're out of time. <laughs> Not for now. Until the next session. And uh, until then, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that makes you feel safe. I don't feel safe. <laughs> Alright, bye then, jackass. We get shot by the feds. Spoilers for Brandon Vowers to come. Press break. <laughs> really, you're gonna give me that again? I'm gonna get fucked. I'm gonna get fucked for this, aren't I? If I'm explaining why I'm getting fucked for this and you can't hear any music, it's because I've muted the audio. If I don't get fucked over by it, then I'll be fine. But there's always a chance of like, hey, this is copyrighted. Especially if they're only having like, like deep silver, isn't it? Is it deep silver? I don't know that name. I don't know that name. I know the Rami Malik, that's a uh, Malik, that's Josh, that is he's just a robot. Hey, you got your robot back. Can I skip it? I cannot skip it. I don't know why I'm fucking... Oh my god, I made him look at me! I'm just gonna get pissed off. I keep making. He's gonna yell at me. Stop turning up our fucking ass. <laughs> Can't skip this. So it's bad. It okay, shouldn't. I'm gonna be so pissed off if it fucks me over. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Why would you be going back? Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. <laughs> One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and They're headed very, out very into the snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Yeah. For joining us, now you feel like shit, don't you? Tonight, Bitch. Her son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. <laughs> All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take this a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And that, uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. 
I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! Fuck you, bitch. Actually, I don't think she's... She... 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 She's so bitch. Yeah, that's what she's doing. Oh, why is the music bad? I don't know if this works episodically or chapter, so... I don't know, I'm going to treat it like a regular place and just do like 20 minute episodes for the level. Like, like the Tales in the Borderlands is going to be an hour long. Each time, five episodes an hour long, because I know it's an episode, but I don't know how this works. Is she the only one on the bus? That is up at one. So maybe it is. Well, I'm gonna end this one here. What should I just turn around and see the fucking murder guy? Okay? Can you not be a cutscene for just a second? Sam, Hannah's best friend. I'm just gonna. Be like, just for one second, Hello? please don't be a cutscene. Someone there? Actually, what am I doing? Um, I'm going to just continue recording straight after this, so I'm going to end this one here. Thank you for watching this episode of Until Dawn. If you'd like to push the like button, if you're new, hit subscribe to join your mother's drive. I'll put something daily, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!